Can I stay up tomorrow night to watch the scary film? Welcome to the 2009 Kez Jousting Awards. Uh, this is the first of its kind because it's never happened before. Uh, with that fabulous introduction, I have to hand you straight over to my colleague and distinguished artist, Bob. Uh, thanks there, Bob, uh, for that very insightful um, insight. Uh, yes, uh, as you say, welcome to the 2009 Kez Jousting Fest. Uh, basically, it's called the Kez Jousting Fest because, well, it's just Kez Jousting, really, to be honest. Um, anyway, uh, uh, hang on, I, I think we're getting something I think, there, Bob. I think, I we, think are. we are. I think we're getting something. Uh, I think they're down in the tournament tent where the uh, actual participants are meeting each other for the yep. very first time. Absolutely. I've got wax in my ear. And I've got no idea why I've got my finger in my ear. Okay then. So. Over to them then. And you are? You've forgotten? Or your name is uh, Um? <laughs> I'm not gay because I might end up having to shag a full woman when he comes back. Sorry, her. Oh, I'd forget as well. What a mouthful. <laughs> and I said then, I said I'm not going to actually put that joke anywhere near there. <laughs> oh, we're back. Well, that seems to be a very, very interesting interview there. I think both responded responded quite well. And, uh, well, yes, it was. It's, it's all there. It's very excited. I'm very excited, but I don't think I'm as excited as my colleague, Bob, who's, well, very excitable. You can take your hands away, Bob. Why not? Just give me the mic. Okay, then. It's, it's, uh, it's exciting, uh, exciting work here today, um, it's, it's amazing stuff seeing how the players interact with one another, it's so, so much, uh, it's, shouldn't have taken that blue potato man, uh, it's good to see how other players are getting on so well, um, pan back, pan back, okay, well thanks very much for that, and let's, hang on, I think I've got another message coming through, I think we're going to the first joust, and over to you, whoever's doing that commentary. So, how exciting was that? I have to say, I was on the edge of my seat. I was on the edge of your seat, actually. Were you? Yeah. Fabulous. So, uh, given that Kez's opponent has no joust, how do you feel the second and final joust will actually end? Well, thank you very much for that, Bob. You know, as, in my opinion, as a professional ex-meat packer, uh, I think that it can go either way at this point. Definitely either way. So we're saying 50-50? Definitely 40-60 split. Yeah, split. Yeah, definitely 50-50, 40-50, 50-50. Something around there. I'll take those odds. 
over to the jousting event for the second and final joust. Kez, over to you. One, two, three, four, I declare a thumb war. You've got any threes? I know pony. Well, after all that excitement, I know I nearly came. So, with all the winnings that you've actually earned from that second and final jazz, what are you going to do? Well, Bob, I tell you right now, I'm actually going to go on holiday. Actually, yeah, it's fine. Well, that's fabulous. Can I have the hat? Thanks. <laughs>